this video, we will talk about the on-device programming functionality of the newly designed LMDC100 that will begin shipping in 2022. Firstly, in order to identify if you have a new or previous version sensor, look for the color matched lenses on the device. Both the PIR and the LMCT lenses on the new version are color matched to the housing. Let's remove the split face of the sensor to expose the configuration and load buttons. Using these buttons, we can access the parameters time delay, PIR sensitivity, and ultrasonic sensitivity. Additionally, test mode and device reset utilities can be commanded. Let's first talk about parameters. To change a parameter, you must first select it using the configuration button. In the installation instructions available on our website, you will find a table in the setting sensor parameter section. On the table, the number of configuration button presses required to select each setting are shown. After selecting a parameter, you can then set its value using the load button. The chart also shows the number of presses corresponding with each available value. Note that more values are available in our programming tools. Finally, exiting the parameter mode is performed by pressing the configure button again, the same number of times used to enter the mode. Let's change time delay from a default of 20 minutes to 25 minutes. I press the configure button three times to enter the parameter setting mode. You'll note that the red LED begins blinking the number of times corresponding to the time delay setting, and the blue LED begins blinking the number of times corresponding to the current value. We want to set this to 25 minutes, so I'll press the button five times. You'll see that the blue LED updates to blink five times corresponding to the updated setting. If I instead wanted to update the sensor to 15 minutes, I can either exit and re-enter the parameter mode or continue cycling through values. To save this setting, I'll press the configuration button three times, corresponding with the time delay setting. Process for updating ultrasonic and PIR sensitivity is identical, but note that the 0% or off value is at position 11. Next, let's discuss utilities. Test mode is used to allow you to, to test the detection range of the sensor by setting time delay to five seconds. To enter test mode, press and hold the load button for any time between three and 10 seconds. The red LED illuminates solidly to indicate that the test mode is active and you can release to enter the mode. To exit test mode, press and hold the load button again for another three to 10 seconds. Finally, there are two reset utilities available. The first will allow you to reset the sensor. You do this by pressing and holding the load button for between 10 to 20 seconds until the red and blue LEDs illuminate solidly. The second reset will allow you to reset all sensors in the room. You do this by pressing and holding the load button for over 20 seconds after which the blue LED will flash. So this concludes the overview of the new on-device programming of the LMDC100. I want to thank you for your time and for choosing Legrand.